Some welding jobs cannot be moved to a shop, especially if the work pieces are outdoors. That's where portable welders come into play. Amir NSM welder come in handy in places as portable welding machines. We are one of the leading manufacturer and supplier of high quality welder such as diesel engine operated welding generator and petrol engine operated portable welder. These portable welders are very durable and have excellent design for efficient welding functionality. Features Reputed engines either air cool or water cool. Choice of AC or DC current depending upon welding requirement. High efficiency. Excellent functionality. Enhanced durability. Extremely compact and portable. How can you weld with Amir NSM welder? It's important to know how to weld properly. Let's learn how to use Amir NSM welder. Here are the basic steps. Check the fuel tank. It's always a good idea to check the tank first to make sure there is enough fuel. If it's low, then you'll have to add more fuel. Use clean and filtered fuel. Ensure that the engine is switched off at the time of adding the fuel to the tank. Check the oil. To have the welder running trouble-free, it is important to ensure recommended grade of oil. Check the oil level and top it up if the level is low. Use recommended grade of oil only. Engine can be recall start or electric start. Start with a pull string to jump start the engine. Give it a good pull once or twice to turn it on. Ensure that the engine start switch is in on position. If your Amir NSM welder comes with an electric start, you can turn it on with a turn off a key. Connect the welding machine. Connect the brass connectors to welding sockets on the welder. Ensure that plus way and way are connected properly. Use necessary safety equipment such as gloves, protector shield while welding. Once the welding machine is connected, you'll be able to start welding. Adjust the current control settings. The current control settings play an important role. It allows you to maintain the right amount of welding current for the required job. Select appropriate amount of current using current selected no based on the welding work, welding rod diameter, and thickness of component to be welded. Turn it off when not in use. You should always turn off equipment when not in use for safety reasons, especially since the fuel emissions can be flammable and combustible. Turning it off will also conserve fuel and power. Store your welder properly. It's important to store your equipment correctly, keeping them safe and dry while not in use will prevent damage and wear from the elements. If you have to leave your equipment at an outdoor job site, it would be a good idea to cover them up with a tarn or waterproof material. Always refer to engine and alternator operators manual. Please contact us for more information 